This woman is in jail tonight after police say she stole a donation jar right there from a local restaurant. It was supposed to be for the family of the little girl who was killed during a shootout in a West Side strip mall parking lot. 46 year old Tammy Cruz right here told police she needed the money to support her crack cocaine addiction. People on 103rd Street telling news for Jax she was a stranger to the area working at El Tapatio, the restaurant where the jar was stolen says $600 was taken Thursday night. News for Jack's reporter Destiny McKeever is live tonight from the restaurant. Destiny. Scott, this has been a very sacred place since that shooting happening last weekend. People have been leaving stuffed animals, balloons, and flowers here at this memorial to pay their respects for young Haiti. Now, I spoke with a pastor earlier who says he's surprised someone would steal from a grieving family. JSO released this mugshot in an update to media saying 46 year old Tammy Cruz is the woman who stole the donation jar for Haiti Rivas Villanueva's family. The jar was stolen from El Tapatio on Thursday. Surveillance video shows Cruz scoping the scene before walking out with the jar in her bag. I cannot judge anybody. Uh, I would guess to uh, look the way to uh, uh, repent herself and and I was set to I repent herself and, and try to get, uh, get this peace with God. Since Haiti's murder, this memorial has grown outside of El Tapatio. As people come to leave tokens of love, they also donate money. El Tapatio raised $600 for Haiti's family. Money Cruz told police she stole for crack cocaine. It's a hard crime during a time like this. So she need to be caught, put the way to have no mercy on me. That's not nice. Nearby restaurants and churches have also stepped in to help Haiti's family. Pastor Ronnie tells me he's praying for the community in desperate times. And Cruz faces grand theft as well as drug charges. It is unclear if Haiti's family will ever receive that $600. Reporting live tonight, I'm Destiny McKeever, Channel 4, The Local Station.